What is a typical client of Star Investment Partners? Are they institutional, advisory, or the end consumer? So in the context of a DFM and an investment manager, Star Investment Partners' ideal client is a financial advisor who has a book that is of a decent size, and a decent size can be anything from 150 million up to a billion rand. That book they're advising on, it could have 50 clients in, it could have 600 clients in. It really doesn't matter to us. Right? The financial advisor's problem in an ideal scenario is that he wants to offer a consistent service to all of his clients. And he wants that service to be linked to a range of products on the investment management side. So for argument's sake, a financial advisor, ideal financial advisor would have the following needs. He needs a low volatility CPI plus two portfolio. He needs a medium volatility uh, uh, a CPI plus four local portfolio. And he needs a high growth CPI plus six balanced portfolio. All of those being regulation 28 compliant or uh, being compliant to the pension regulation in South Africa. In addition, he needs global product, a global solution that allows his discretionary money, always offshore money, uh, uh, always pension money to be managed in prudent ways, again, addressing stability and, uh, uh, and, and um, consistency. So a cash plus portfolio globally, what I call a moderate risk balanced portfolio, a higher growth portfolio, and in some instances, a pure equity portfolio. In our experience, the ideal financial advisor seldom has clients who are wanting to go purely offshore, full tilt, wanting to be in very specific uh, 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 stocks. So that's the ideal investment client. We are not too concerned about the size of that client. As I said, the ideal is probably between 150 and a billion, but where somebody is starting out new and they've got a high growth business, uh, we're very happy to partner from an early stage. And in fact, it's much better to partner early than to find yourself switching um, at a late stage in, in, in your uh, business cycle. So I think that is probably our ideal uh, client. And that client doesn't necessarily have to be based in the same city where we're based can be based anywhere around South Africa, and quite honestly, in this day and age, can be based anywhere in the world, as long as those similar objectives apply.